What's up everybody, Mechrex here, and I'm here back in Vega Conflict. I'm willing to... I've opened up just about every single gold box that I had. I still have like 10 left I have to buy, but so far I've gotten Heretic, Cruiser, stuff like that. Stuff that I don't really need because I have the Xeno Division, but there's ships all together that I don't have to take the time to build. I just have to fit. But I'm going to pick up the last 10 boxes here with you all and open them all one at a time. Or maybe all at once. Probably open five and then open the other five all at once. Yeah. Sounds like an idea. What do we got in box number one? Number two. We have driver. Number three. Torpedo, Wave Driver, Wave Driver, and that's what I wanted. I literally just got everything from them. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Let's pull all you out. I literally just got all five of these today. The Frasia Carrier was actually something I don't even have, so. I think, do I have, I think I have a range, I think I have two level one ranger squadrons. I think one level two swarm. Do I, do not, I have none. Do I have none? I have none. That figures. Well, I'm slowly converting all the smaller stuff into bigger stuff and the bigger stuff into even bigger stuff, so... Yeah, that process is going to take a while. I figured I'd open the boxes with you, and that that was just luck, because I was hoping I'd get the Frasia carrier out of that one for an obvious reason, just to have an extra carrier. But tomorrow in the morning, I will be... Let's see. Yeah, I'll be able to start refitting Standing by. the Javelin with the new engine well the jump drive and my thoughts are still the same as before on the mobilization it's only good for this resources gold prize boxes for low tier players or pvp what I find hilarious is you can't even use the weapons that come in this box with the weapon with the ships because they're all the demon core only and guess what iron star company so that's hilarious. I think it's is it the same with you? No. These ones can actually be used on anything. Frenzied. Scatter. I wonder which one's better of them. But I'm going to start farming up the resources. Actually, I don't even need the resources because I'm full. I guess I could go after the decimator cutter box, even though I know I won't get any. Actually, don't waste it there. Let's see. What do we have down here? What was in the silver? Valkyrie, Corinthian, and Zeal. Eh, tier 4 stuff won't hurt. In the end, it's all stuff that'll get blown up. Just like the Xeno. Well, that'll be it for this episode, well, for this video. This is just another little short catch-up, and they they could have done so much better with the boxes that were in here for the Xeno Division. They could have actually given guaranteed prizes for these ones and not had antimatter in there at all, because, I mean, I still understand, because I was at, like, 80, 80 mil yesterday when I got the boxes the first time around. I didn't get a single drop fit, but I didn't get anything else, so. Didn't get patterns, nor the antimatter. And I checked the higher tier boxes. <laughs> the, these. You need the Mark II's to upgrade to the Marks above that. That's just. You can't upgrade if you can't find it. <laughs> you need to be the luckiest human being alive to get a Xeno pattern without buying it. <laughs> but other than that, I've just been researching stuff. 
and changing stuff into bigger stuff. And oh yeah, and then I have that giant blob fleet of nothing but red up here. Yeah. I was farming a lot of those ships. <laughs> but that'll be it for today's episode. It'll be all caught up and everything like that for now. I've hardly earned any intel. Wow. Well. Hope y'all enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next one.